One News. A man who worked as a choir conductor and school teacher is found shot to death. The victim, 47-year-old Donald Young. Good evening, everyone. Young's death has been ruled a homicide. His body was discovered yesterday morning inside his south side home at 2320 East 69th Street. ABC 7's Michelle Gallardo is here now with more on the case and how Young is being remembered tonight. Michelle? Ravi, Donald Young was the fourth of eight siblings. He was, according to those who loved him, the type of person who didn't take life for granted. He lived every day to the fullest. So whether it was in the South Side classroom where he taught or at church conducting the choir every Sunday, Young made an impression on those who met him. He was one of those success stories in terms of a kid whom the average person would look at and say he doesn't have a chance. And yet, before his death, Donald Young succeeded mightily. Among other things, he was a choir conductor at Trinity United Church of Christ for many years. This amateur video, shot just last week, shows him doing what for him wasn't a profession, but a calling. He came to our church as a 12-year-old. Uh, he didn't. And he was not brought by his mother and father. That kind of, he just came because of the other kids and became active in the church. The church became Young's extended family. When news of his killing came during Sunday morning services, Reverend Wright tells us many parishioners got up and went straight to Young's home. This third floor apartment on the 2300 block of East 69th Street is where Young was found by his roommate, shot to death. He was a person who believed in loving people with God love, agape love that a lot of us don't, unconditional love. Young was also a fifth grade teacher at Guggenheim Elementary. And tonight, family spokesperson Dennis Cole told us Young had just finished a double master's in early child education and math. His ambition.